Little Billy back at it again with another vlog video and today I'm going to get a Craigslist find right now in between classes and I mile, use the left lane to merge onto oh I two seventy nine south. But anyways, we are going to a Craigslist deal and this is crazy because yesterday I posted a wanted Craig I wanted I posted a wanted video games thing. So I posted that on Craigslist and this woman emailed me and she said, I have a Sega C D thing with the N sixty four and a um N64 with a couple games. She said N64 with Tony Hawk, and she didn't say like anything, anything special. So I said, send a picture of your stuff. She has an N64 of Mario Party, Pokemon Stadium, and a couple of the games with all the quads and stuff, and a Sega CD console. This is a Sega, yeah, Sega CD Model 2 console, and I'm getting it right now for a hundred bucks. The right lane to stay on I-279 South. Then use the left lane to take the exit toward downtown. And this is crazy because this is like insane. I'm getting all this Use stuff for 100 bucks. Take the exit Fuck you. Toward downtown, then keep left. I'm selling all this stuff for 100 bucks. Or not all the stuff. I'm selling an N64 for 100 bucks. Or, oh my god, I can't talk. I'm selling the N64 for 40 bucks. Maybe Pokemon, maybe Mario Party for 50 bucks. Keep left. So I'll have 90 bucks and I'll have in my collection a Sega CD and Pokemon Stadium. And that's all I care about is this Sega CD title. This is amazing. This is so crazy. I can't wait to get it. But a crazy part is she, the, she said, okay. She said, okay, you can have it, and okay, I'll take a hundred bucks. Then three minutes later, she posts only the N64. Shit. Then she put, a little bit later, she only posts the N64 on OfferUp, and you can't hide this from me. I'm on every single, I'm on every single thing. OfferUp, LeftGo, Craigslist, eBay, like, I'm on every single thing, and I check it, like, all the day now, because it's, it's March, it's getting warm, I'm going to flea markets every Sunday now, so you cannot hide this stuff from me. And I swear to God, she posted this N64 bundle on $120, and I said, I'm done, I'm getting this stuff right now before you sell it to somebody else. So she only, she was going to sell the N64 bundle for $120, only, only the N64 bundle, and I'm getting, I'm getting everything for 100 bucks. So I was like, I'm getting this shit right now, I swear to God, I swear to God I'm getting this stuff right now. And this is going to be amazing. I, I'll see you guys back in a little bit right with the stuff. But, man, this woman seems shady because she really was trying to sell the stuff on freaking off -up. Okay, I'll be back. Just went to the house and I finally got it for 100 bucks. I got this N64, two controllers, like five games-ish. This Tony Hawk game. Let's see. Um... I don't know, I can't really show you. This Sega CD Model 2, oh my god, this is amazing. This for a hundred bucks, and it was so weird. You know that saying, take, look at that Mario Party though, oh my god. You know the saying, take the money and run? Well, that's kind of what I did tonight, because that's what I did today, because she's like, she came out with the bag, the bag of N64 stuff, I'll show it to you when I get home. So she came out with the stuff, and I was like, okay, I looked through the stuff, and all I was looking for is that Mario Party, okay? Because obviously- Okay, so the camera stopped. But anyways, you know that the saying, take the money and run. I went and I got it. And then the Mario Party wasn't in it. So that's all I was looking for. So Mario Party was in the bag. It wasn't in the bag. So she's like, um, it's like broken or something. And like, I don't know if you wanted it or something. She was so weird. She was, I don't know what was going on. But then I was like, I was like, where's the Mario Party? And she's like, what? And I'm like, where's the Mario Party? She couldn't really hear me because this thing outside. And I'm like, do you still have it? And she's like, well, it's broken. So I said, can you go and get it? Because I still want it. And she's like, she's like, I guess. And she's like, can I have the stuff so you won't just take it? And then I'm like, Kaden? So I gave her the stuff and she came out. She got it and she's like, I just, I lied. My boyfriend said it was broken and I believed him. Did his boy, did her boyfriend not want to sell it or something? It was so weird, but I finally got it. You know, if you go to a yard sale, this is one tip. If you go to a yard sale or something, take it and run. Give them the money if it's a good deal and just dip. Because if you're like, oh, can you call me back later? If you say that, they're not going to call you back. They don't care about you. They just care about the money. They just, you know, this is what I did today. I had to get this and run with it because I felt like she wouldn't. 
I don't know. I just had to. I had to run with it, and I finally got it. Hopefully that works. I don't know. I don't even have the quartz with it, with the CD. I know that she said the N64 works, two controllers, all that stuff. So everything for 100 bucks. I can sell two things to get my money back and keep the CD and Pokemon Stadium and the other games. This is late. This is, what is it? It's M March 29th. We're about to be in April. Flea markets, yard sale stuff, guys. If you want to find games, this is it. And I cannot believe I finally got it. Cause when you put, when I put a one in posting list, it's, people tell me and stuff, but they never go through with it. This is crazy. This was only 10 minutes from my school, and this was, oh my god, I cannot. I'm gonna show you the stuff later, but I cannot believe I got this stuff. Mario Party on N64. You never ever seen this, like ever. And in a Sega CD console, never. Like wow. Like you see it. You see it in stores and stuff, but you're not going to see it at a flea market for like five bucks. This is amazing. I cannot believe this. Like, mm, I love this. So guys, I'm going to show you stuff later on. I had to go back to school at like 12 o'clock. It's only 11. So yeah, see you later and I'll show you the stuff later. It is lit, as they say. Hello, Billy here with the next day. And, and we are here. I just, um, this is after I got all the stuff the next day. And it's pretty lit because... I have the Sega CD hooked up. I borrowed Ian's Genesis first model and it freaking works. It is so amazing. And I have the full combo now, which is the Genesis 32X CD. <laughs> it's so amazing. So the games I got with this, with this whole thing was, it's a, there's a, a couple downstairs. I'll go to them later. But a couple of them are Pokemon, what is this, Pokemon Stadium. This Tony Hawk game, this wrestling game, and for some reason there's a SNES game in this, which I don't mind. It's this Pac-Man game. I'm I'm not really sure. And then the Mario Party's downstairs. So that's pretty lit. There was two those two other games that were there was this other Tony Hawk game and this like racing game on N64. They were so disgusting. Like I had to get rid of them. Like I opened them up, and it, it seems like somebody put them in water, and, because it was so much rust, and I'm just like, yeah, they're not, it's not worth it to even, like, clean, it's not even worth it to clean it, so I just, like, threw it away, so it was so, it was so bad, so, and then, like, the label on their racing game was so bad, so I'm like, I'm not even gonna put this in my N64, so I'm gonna go downstairs and show you the rest of the stuff. Oh, yeah, I also got a SNES. Super Nintendo Power Brick for some reason. I'm like, why did I get this? Like, this guy, this this person must have had a Super Nintendo somewhere. So here we are. This is the trade bait, pretty much. N64 with Mario Party. And pretty much, I went, I put this on Craigslist just for 120 I know it seems like a lot. It's kind of more than what it's worth. But if somebody pays 120 I'll definitely take it. But, yeah, Mario Party, though. This, all these things... All the thing, all the stuff was disgusting. Like most of the games, like I said, the two games. But there was like two games that were normal for some reason. But like one of these controller wires, I, I'm gonna show you a picture right now. It's over this. It was so freaking disgusting. I cannot even believe it. Like it was disgusting. Like everything was gross. So the game, so were the games. Like Mario Party was pretty gross. Pokemon Stadium had crap in the bottom of it. It was so disgusting. But anyways, it was, it was pretty lit. And two controllers with like really good analog sticks and stuff like that. So that's pretty much it. Um, that's pretty much all the stuff I got. Like the Sega CD and like all those games, you know, like a hundred bucks definitely for definitely a Sega CD and Pokemon Stadium. I'll get my money back from from this and I keep the CD in the Pokemon Stadium. So I would say it's a good uh, it's a good um, it's a good start to like the season you could say game collecting season because we are so close to full blown flea markets coming soon so guys have i hopefully enjoy the small vlog this will be uploaded sunday this today's thursday so hopefully you enjoy the small vlog and game on build and out but you get the point hey guys hope you really like that video and if you did please like comment and subscribe you should also check out our Twitter, Facebook, and Tumblr. See you again soon! soon.